Welcome back to IBM Sunrise. Now you've seen CEOs attend board meetings, jet across the world and strike big business deals. But now you'll see them like never before, turning singers, all to raise funds to treat critically ill children. Deepa Balakrishnan reports. Call it the Saturday night fever, but all for a good cause, when nine jet-setting CEOs from corporate India lent their voices to a charity event, suitably titled, CEOs Sing for Their Supper. But for the likes of Biocon founder and MD Kiran Mazumdar Shaw, the exercise was pure passion singing. I don't think I'm quite singing for my supper because I'm on a diet, but uh, certainly I'm singing for these wonderful young kids who need our help. While the Biocon founder is trained in Hindustani music, there were other CEOs who admitted to belting out romantic numbers only to cheer their better hearts. Yeah, so largely bathroom training. Uh, haven't trained uh, uh, specially. So this is just uh, extra time in college put to a different use. And since then, just a passion that has you know, just out of own interest have kept it going. This fundraiser by Genesis Foundation aimed to raise about 15 lakh rupees to treat seven children suffering from heart disorders and cancer. Also, I found that there were a lot of closet singers amongst the CEOs. And though they did sing at home or they sang in college and never got an opportunity again, I thought, why not use that and sort of raise funds? And with other executives swaying to these tunes, it was certain that music emerged as a great healer. In Bangalore, Deepa Balakrishnan. My magic existence, my fit, my promise.